Hi everyone! So today I'm going to kind of unbox Sephora's um, like countdown to Christmas, right? So I don't think, like they call it an advent calendar. So it does kind of show you on the back what the things are. So I kind of wish it was a surprise. Like I know like some people are like, Mah. I want to know what I'm buying beforehand. But that ruins things. Like I like things to be a surprise. Like that's the part of an advent calendar. So kind of going through it. Like it has multiple parts, so you kind of open it all up. Bam. And it's a little cute, right? So let me find number one. <laughs> so the first one is kind of like a fizzy cube. So I still have like, because I bought this kind of like last year. So I still have the one from like last year and I don't think I've like used them, right? So like, yeah, it's kind of like nice. Uh, but I like my like lush bath bombs, I think. So then you get an eyeliner. So it's a mini size in that. So just kind of putting it right. You can get a nice thin line. And then I'm just going to test this out on my face and see what I can get from using things. It's not a bad black eyeliner. Um, I'm definitely going to now appear a little goth throughout the video. I do think when you put it on your waterline, you want to be very careful because it does really like uh, glide on easily. It's been such a long time since I put like black eyeliner on my eyes and stuff like that. Um, but I'm really hoping <clears throat> um, soon comes a shadow so my eyes don't appear so tiny. Then you get a um, universal brow free. So it's just kind of like, can't really see anything from that, but it's just kind of like a clear wax. keep your eyebrows in place. So like not a bad product, right? For Is you get a little nail polish. So let's test this out. So I do like the brush because it's more like a flat brush. And like it's a nice color right so a nice Christmas red so I'm not mad at that and it's like a cute little egg shape five is a red liner lip crown So 
not too bad, right? I'm really creating a look here. Um, definitely don't think it goes with what color I'm wearing. Uh, I did not intentionally wear green, so I'm looking really Christmas and that. Um, so like, it's not dry, so it's not too bad. I would like, I don't really put like, uh, a pencil, like I wouldn't necessarily really use a pencil overall. Like I like my liquid lipsticks, so I don't have any transfer. So it's five, six. You get another little bath bomb and it smells kind of like baby powder so like I'm not the biggest fan of baby powder smells seven these ones in the corner are so hard to get out so you get their cream stain in one so I feel like I have a lot of little samples of these so like kind of disappointed that like it's the same color that they kind of give out. So it's not like a bad color, right? Um, and like, obviously, like, it's nice that it matches the lip liner that you're given. So I think it is kind of like playing it safe. And I feel like some of these, like, products are similar to what they gave from last year. So... It's not like every year you're getting something different, like a lot of kind of those repeats of things so you get some makeup removers and these are really great to like throw in your purse like I definitely brought them to the beach with me and stuff like that uh, just because it's very easy to kind of bam remove so I do like the concept of little individual wrapped makeup removers Um, you get a creamy body wash. So this is in blueberry. So like, I still have my ones from like last year. Like I kind of brought them with me, but never really used when I went traveling. But it, again, like it's something nice to have if you're going to travel. Then you got nail polish remover wipes. Um, so like they're okay. I do find like these wipes kind of like dry out fast. So you probably will end up using two. But they're like little great ones to have um, and kind of carry with you. So if like you're someone who's like, ah, oh, my nail chipped. I need to take all off, take off all my nail polish. Then these are kind of great to just throw in your purse. So the convenience of them are really nice. 11 is you get another nail polish. This one's in a new color. And I feel like I'm not going to like this one. Oh, and I'm right. So this is kind of like your milky color for French manicure, right? And as it's drying more and more, like, no, that one is a boo. You get a little nail file. So that's always great because you could always use one. I feel like it should have come sooner before the polish. Thirteen, you get stickers. So that I just feels a slap in the face. Like they're bent. And like, like, no, 
that to me is where it like really just makes it little kid and stuff like that. Like I get if you're going to do like pins, okay, but stickers is just kind of a waste. You get a little curly ha hair tie. So these aren't too bad. Oh, and there's glitter in it. Right? So they're not bad at all. For like throwing up your hair. 15. You get like a little owl post-its, right? So like even like that's better than stickers, right? Something a little cute. I definitely feel like this would be something good for like studying, put, marking a page and whatnot. Sixteen. As you get a flat face sponge. So that's something nice, and I don't think they had that last year. Seventeen. As you get their nose strip. So like it's not bad, right? Of a nose strip. And I do like the charcoal one. So I find this one kind of good for like also shrinking your pores as you use it. It's a little stuck there. So 17, 18. Is you get like a matte eyeshadow. So you get a little matte eyeshadow. That's like in a new color. Like there's really like no color for me in that. So I wish they would have done like a nice brown shade. Blah, blah, blah. Like not a bad eyeshadow. Go back in your hole. You get a blush. And I do like the packaging of it. So nice kind of dusty rose color. Is you get a little mirror. So I think like the mirror to come sooner would be a little nicer. Like I feel like I'd rather the like crappy little ones first. Right? It's so like 13 of the stickers should be number one. So it just kind of gets better from there. Twenty-one. Is you get another little bath bomb. So it is nice that they're kind of separating these out so they're not the, not all at the same time. Twenty-two. You get one of their lipsticks. Ooh. So 
that's like hashtag matte and that's how much product you get but it's just such like a weird finish it's definitely like nice and creamy Twenty-three more makeup removers. So I think like to do like a double of a product is a little bit lame. And then twenty-four you finish with a blue hair tie. Like I definitely think like how they like, I think your lipstick should have kind of been, like, 24, right? Because that's probably, like, one of the better ones out there that's something different and whatnot. So, like, it's about $56, and I just feel like, like, Body Shop kind of does, like, a better one out there. But that's just all skincare, like that's majority skincare. They do kind of have some of those beauty items. But again, you're probably going up more in the expensive uh, option that they have. Um, like red nail polish was nice. The pink one wasn't. Like you get stickers. So it's like, meh. A little. I think it's probably like you're getting your value of it. Right? To get like 24 things, you're kind of looking at like two. So it's like 60 bucks for 24 things. So you're looking at about like over $2 each item. So when you kind of compare it that way, you're like, okay, not too bad. Um, definitely like stickers. Like, let's do better, Sephora. I, I know you have it in you right? Like, it's not even, like, I think, like, you could do, like, the bejeweled stuff, and, like, that's at least something a little bit more makeup-y than, like, oh, okay, here's some stickers, or, like, I don't know. Like, I feel like eh, you're not gonna really hit everyone with that. Like, I feel, you know, throw on a pair of tweezers, something like that. Uh, and like, don't do doubles of things. But overall, not too bad. Some different things, but like, if you kind of got this box last year, or like you buy a lot of Sephora's things, like you'll have that lipstick will be the same. So it's kind of what you have if you're interested in it. So I would say like something that's kind of missing from this kit, like looking at my full face is mascara. So it would have been really nice if they added mascara, maybe get rid of one of the lip products, right? Do more of like, like a red lipstick or like still do that mauve because I think it's a little bit different and we'll go for different things. Um, but like throw in a mascara, throw in a highlighter so that you can actually do a complete makeup look. And then I think this would be more worthwhile. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Hope you have a great day. Bye.